Hi, Franklin Pillsbury with Marine Max here in beautiful Fort Myers, Florida, right here on the river on the intercoastal waterway. Today, excited to bring you a uh, 55 gallon fly. So this has the complete fly bridge. This one is a convertible, so the nice thing is the top can go all the way down. As we walk forward here, you're gonna notice this big, beautiful deck. Great sun lounging up here on the bow area, as well as the uh, light that goes down into the cabin. Galleon is now the number one selling boat in the country here in the United States for boats 40 to 70 foot. Absolutely a wonderful boat. Excited to tell you about this one. Three staterooms, nice galley aft, hydraulic swim platform, all kinds of neat stuff. Let's head on back and take a look. One of the greatest features on this 55 to me is the way this opens up in the back. The lanai opens up back here in the back. Yes, I said lanai and the teak beach as we go to the back. But this glass opens all the way up and the galley is aft. So for entertaining, for cooking and enjoying, everything flows to the back of the boat. Got an extra refrigerator over here. Uh, super neat storage areas all up and down this uh, side, the starboard side. Nice big countertop to lay stuff out here as well. Once again, take a look at the detail on the woodwork as well as all the storage. You're also going to notice that the air conditioning comes out high so that it falls. Gives us more cool air obviously in the upper side and falls down here towards the bottom. Nice big galley area, big windows on both sides so that you got plenty of light to look out. Cooktop, microwave oven, upright refrigerator, absolutely super. So as we come up here into the salon area, nice big horseshoe shaped seating so that we've got room to put six, eight adults right here. Table will drop down. Uh, there's a photo online you can look at with the cushion in here because this absolutely is one of the greatest spots to lay out and lounge and enjoy the boat. Also the seats over here, these will slide over and make a sitting area. You'll see a photo of that as well where we've got extra seating. And then if we want to watch TV, typical kind of galleon style here, super neat little deal where the TV will pop up here. And as I mentioned, a great area over here for the kids. Uh, or if you want to watch a movie late at night or a football game, got lots of space there to watch that TV. Nice big windows, drapes that drop down. Okay, and then as we come forward up here in the helm, going to notice really super nice complement of the twin Raymarine screens. You're going to notice on this one right now that I've got the boat pulled up here. So anything and everything I want to do on the boat, I can operate right there. So the window, like this window right here, I can raise it up and down. And I got to tell you, the breeze is absolutely remarkable today. Uh, got the uh, digital controls as well as the bow and stern thruster and this boat has the yacht controller. So anywhere that I want to be on the boat, I can drive and operate the boat with this yacht controller. So pulling up to a lock, pulling up to a dock, putting the tender in and out of the water, everything right here. Also nice big double wide helm seat, great visibility. And one of the neat things on the galleon with the inboard motors, the helm is a little further forward, so if you're driving from here, you've also got an absolutely super ride. Absolutely dynamite bridge on this 55, super big fly area. Uh, complete helm up here on the uh, deck as well. Raymarine, our Volvo Penta gauges over here as well. Got our autopilot as well as the Fusion stereo system. Uh, nice big double wide helm. And take a look at this huge sitting area up here for people to lounge and enjoy. And the nice thing with the convertible top is if you want to get the sun up here, all we got to do is fold it back very, very easily. This table area, we've had 16 people sitting at this big dining table. That's almost like a big Texas barbecue. But these will fold up, fold in so it's very easy to get in and around and uh, absolutely enjoy this area. Uh, over here we've got a wet bar area with the isotherm ice maker as well as the refrigerator. And for those that know me, my favorite part, the Kenyan grill. Absolutely wonderful grilling up here on the bridge and enjoying life out here on this 55 Galleon. Let's go down and take a look at the rear cockpit. 
the swim platform, and then you're going to be ready to come take a look at this boat. You know, this uh, 55 has got some of the greatest social zones of any boat of uh, this size. Another nice, big, beautiful area back here where we've got this uh, area to sit. And again, the table will fold out here and make a great area for dining. Our galley, as we talked about, where we can serve back here, super, super easy. Once again, you can look at the pictures with the lanai door closed, and it's wonderful. Also, as you saw when we came down earlier, we've got a nice big walkway going forward, so it's easy to access the bow and those beautiful cushions up front. Also, I want to talk about the swim platform. One of the neat things on the galleon is when you deploy the swim platform, the teak beach, there's actually steps down in the water so that it's easy to get in and out of the water on the swim platform. You know, it's always exciting to be in the bilge of a galleon. They spend so much time not only designing but on the detail. You'll notice everything in here is very clean and neat. All the band clamps, all the tie straps, you don't see any loose ends. Also, I love the white bilge down in here so that it's easy to see if you have any leaks or anything that might need service. Also reflects the light back up here as well. Also, you notice all the hardware, all the switches, all the mains on the bulkhead, everything very, very easily to get to and marked in a really, really great well. Volvo motors speak for themselves, obviously. And just a reminder, these are straight shaft drives so you don't have any maintenance under the water. Everything is right up here in the bilge, easy to get to. You know, another great feature on the 55 Galleon Fly is the crew quarters, which has great easy access off the swim platform. And if you need that mate, got a bed they can sleep in here, or the captain, uh, or grandkids. But one of the greatest features is it can be used as a cabana when you're swimming and playing off the back of the boat. Full head with a shower, um, as well as great storage and some other areas in here, and a door that walks right into the, uh, to the engine compartment and into the uh, bilge area. Also, our sea keeper is built in underneath uh, the cabinet back here, so easy to get to that and double check that as well. Very, very cool feature on a 55-foot boat. Our Galleon 55 Fly has three staterooms with a total of six bunks or six areas for people to sleep. We're in the VIP cabin right now, and this is huge. Look at the head clearance that I've got in here, as well as the space to move around the bed. I can go all the way around the bed uh, for making it, getting in and out of the bed. Also, look at the beautiful window and the view that we have out that window. Opening uh, glass over here as well. Storage everywhere. You'll see the cabinets forward. Lots of great overhead storage on both sides. And once again, take a look at the detail in that woodwork. And then, uh, sorry, as I walk down here, you'll see that we've got a full uh, set of drawers down here. And the neat thing on these drawers, they're the self-closing drawers. Beautiful woodwork, great detail on the galleons. Also, hanging locker on both sides of the boat, lit so that it's very easy. TV here with our DirecTV satellite box. And as I was talking about, look at the detail on this door. All the wood is inlaid, everything is finished, and then it's installed on the boat. Really nice fit and finish with the galleon. Right now, if I wanted to go to the head, I've got access here out of the uh, stateroom, as well as a door in the hallway for day use. Again, another great stateroom here on the Galleon 55. And as I mentioned, we've got a door that comes right off of the guest VIP stateroom into a full-sized head. Uh, I've got the uh, potty down here, the electric flush potty. Also, you'll notice great natural light coming in as well as an opening porthole. Super storage up above with a mirror, vanity, nice sink, storage down below. And in the shower, we've got a waterfall as well as the regular handheld or fixed shower up here as well. Also, the doorway on the side going out into the hallway for day use. Nice big head, lots of headroom. Just another great feature to go along with this stateroom forward in the 55. So we've talked about we have three private staterooms where we can sleep six people very, very comfortably. We're now in the master stateroom, aft, full beam. What a great spot to be. I'm six foot one and I've got head clearance not only down in the cabin, but up here alongside the bed. Also, we've got great storage all the way down this side. Uh, big windows on each side to let that natural light in as well. 
Uh, great reading lamp here. Once again, separate air conditioning to control the temperature in this cabin. TV with satellite, absolutely a great boat. Look at the detail again with all the lights, the uh, backboard, the headboard here on the bed as well. So as we walk over to the other side, again, look at the headroom that we've got here. Also notice I've got great drawers on either side of the bed down here. But this vanity, this is a neat area, especially with this big window over here, where in the morning, if you want to sit down here and read, or you want to have that cup of coffee and be able to look out and see the beauty, or for the lady, there's a great makeup mirror and a little vanity area here as well. Also, I just want to take advantage of pointing out, look at the detail, once again, the galleon does in the woodwork on the boat. Absolutely one of the neatest, best looking boats that I've ever seen as far as finish, fit, and all that kind of stuff with the cabins. Absolutely wonderful master stateroom. If this doesn't get you to buy the boat, I'm not sure what will. You know, you wouldn't have a great master stateroom without a great master head. And if you take a look in here, once again, I've got plenty of headroom. Got the waterfall shower right here, as well as the handheld shower. And uh, the other thing is it's very quiet back here in this whole stateroom area and whatnot. Beautiful inlaid tile floor, a window in the shower as well as a window in the head. Nice big vanity area, great storage. Once again, what a great boat to come on and spend the weekend. And as we get ready to leave this uh, aft stateroom here on the 55 Galleon, a couple of things I want to show you. We talked about how quiet and nice it is in here, detail on fit and finish. But this door closes off. I've got this whole stateroom, door to the head, and this is where our washer dryer is as well. So just a really neat, complete, private stateroom back here. I close that door and I'm back here on my own. Quiet, nice, get that chance to wake up in the morning and look out that window. So we are in it. Believe it or not, we're in the third stateroom on this Great Galleon 55 Fly. And uh, this is twin single beds but they will pull together very, very easily and make a full-size bed or almost a, a queen-size bed in here as well. Also, this stateroom has its own air conditioning unit, so it's very easy to keep it controlled uh, on its own, as well as this nice big window, once again, to get natural light in here, but also if you're in the cabin, you're not gonna get claustrophobic. Also, we have an opening uh, porthole in the rear, Great lighting overhead, as well as the reading lights above the bunks. Just another great idea and another great way to take care of your guest here on the Galleon 55. Franklin Pillsbury with Marine Max here in Fort Myers, Florida. And again, thank you for looking at the 55 Galleon Fly with me. Give me a call. Come on down here or come across the road. Wherever you are, you need to own this boat. Come see us.